picture this, a country smaller than the state of Montana, yet it houses some of the world's most iconic car brands. Porsche, Mercedes-Benz, Audi, BMW, all hail from Germany. An impressive feat, isn't it? Buckle up as we journey through the evolution of German car companies, a story of innovation, resilience, and sheer engineering prowess. In the late 1800s, Germany was already making its mark in the automotive industry. It all began in 1886, when Karl Benz, a name you may recognize, patented the first automobile, the Benz Patent Motorwagen. This three-wheeled vehicle was a revolution, setting the stage for what would become a powerhouse industry in Germany. Fast forward to the early 20th century, and two more familiar names entered the scene, BMW and Audi. BMW, an acronym for Bayerische Motor und Werke, started its journey in 1916. Initially, BMW was known for producing aircraft engines, but after the end of World War I, they pivoted to motorcycles and then cars. The first car they produced was the BMW Dixie, and the rest, as they say, is history. Audi, on the other hand, has a unique story. The company was formed in 1932 from the merger of four different German car companies, each represented by a ring in the now famous Audi logo. Audi's focus on technology and innovation has been evident from the start, with the company being the first to perform crash tests for safety. Then, in the 1930s, a new player entered the game, Volkswagen. The company was established by the German labor front under Adolf Hitler's regime with the intention of making cars more accessible to the German public. The result was the Volkswagen Beetle, a car that would go on to sell over 21 million units worldwide and become a symbol of German engineering. The post-war era saw a boom in German car companies, with Mercedes-Benz and Porsche joining the party. Mercedes-Benz, a merger of Daimler and Benz and C, emerged as a leader in luxury vehicles, while Porsche, founded by Ferdinand Porsche, became synonymous with sports cars. Fast forward to the present day, and German car companies are at the forefront of the shift towards sustainable mobility. They are leading the charge in electric vehicle technology, with BMW's i-Series, Audi's e-tron, and Mercedes-Benz's EQ range. In summary, the evolution of German car companies is a testament to their commitment to innovation, quality, and design. From the first patented automobile to today's electric vehicles, German car companies have consistently pushed the boundaries of what's possible, establishing themselves as leaders in the global automotive industry. It's a journey that has spanned over a century, and one thing is clear. The road ahead for German car companies is as exciting as the one they've already traveled. Did you know that the name Germany comes from a Roman term, Germania, which was used to describe a group of tribes in the region? That's right. The term Germania was first used by the Romans around the first century BC to describe the tribes living to the east of the Rhine River. This fascinating fact is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to the intriguing origins of Germany. Delving deeper into the past, we find that the roots of Germany stretch back even further than the Romans to the Celtic tribes that inhabited the region around 500 BC. These tribes, known for their artistry and warrior culture, left their mark on the land with remnants of their hill forts and artifacts still found across the country today. But, of course, the Romans weren't just content with naming the region. No, they had bigger plans in mind. By the first century AD, they had conquered much of the southern parts of Germania, leaving their indelible Roman footprint on the land. Roman roads, walls and cities, like the ancient city of Trier, stand testament to this era of Roman dominance. Yet, the Romans' reign was not to last forever. The mighty Roman Empire eventually fell and the lands of Germania became a patchwork of tribal kingdoms. Over time, these kingdoms gradually coalesced into larger political entities, leading to the formation of the Holy Roman Empire in the 10th century. This empire, which ironically was neither holy nor Roman nor an empire, was a complex political entity that encompassed much of Central Europe, including modern-day Germany. Despite its name, the Holy Roman Empire was a significant milestone in the formation of a distinct German identity. So, the Germany we know today has a rich and complex history that dates back thousands of years. 
from the Celtic tribes and Roman conquerors to the formation of the Holy Roman Empire. Each chapter in Germany's past has left an indelible mark on the country's identity, shaping it into the fascinating nation it is today. Moving forward to the Middle Ages, Germany was at the heart of the Holy Roman Empire. But how did it evolve from there? The Middle Ages in Germany were marked by the towering presence of the Holy Roman Empire. This complex political entity, which spanned several European territories, was a melting pot of diverse cultures and traditions. Over a thousand years, the empire saw countless emperors, kings and nobles battling for power, shaping the political and cultural landscape of Germany. One of the major highlights of this period was the rise of the Hanseatic League. This powerful confederation of merchant guilds and market towns stretched across northern Europe, from the Baltic to the North Sea. The League played a pivotal role in fostering economic growth and facilitating trade, and its influence can still be seen today in the beautifully preserved Hanseatic cities that dot Germany's landscape. But the Middle Ages were also a time of religious upheaval. In the early 16th century, the Protestant Reformation, spearheaded by Martin Luther, shook the foundations of the Catholic Church. This movement, which began in Germany, spread rapidly across Europe, leading to the creation of Protestant churches and fundamentally changing the religious map of the continent. However, the Middle Ages were not without their share of strife. The Thirty Years' War, a protracted and devastating conflict, ravaged Germany in the 17th century. This war, fought largely on German soil, resulted in immense human and economic losses. The culmination of these events led to the eventual dissolution of the Holy Roman Empire in the early 19th century. This marked the end of an era, paving the way for the modern state of Germany. Despite the hardships and upheaval, the Middle Ages and beyond were a time of significant transformation, shaping Germany into the nation we know today. Thus, the Middle Ages and beyond were a time of great change and upheaval for Germany. In the 19th century, Germany underwent a significant transformation. Can you guess what that was? Yes, it was unification. Before this period, Germany was not a single country as we know it today, but a jigsaw puzzle of independent states. Then came the Kingdom of Prussia, a powerful force that led the charge for unification. Under the leadership of Chancellor Otto von Bismarck, Prussia won three short, decisive wars that culminated in the proclamation of a unified German Empire in 1871. Imagine the thrill of that moment, the birth of a nation from the ashes of division. Yet, the 20th century brought new challenges. Two world wars left a deep and indelible mark on Germany. The Great War, or World War I, led to the downfall of the German Empire and the Treaty of Versailles left the nation beleaguered and resentful. Then came World War II, a conflict of unprecedented scale and devastation, with Germany at its epicenter. The nation's cities were flattened, its people suffered, and its reputation was tarnished on the world stage. But the aftermath of World War II brought about another significant change. The victorious Allied powers divided Germany into East and West, the Iron Curtain descended and the nation found itself split in two. East Germany, under Soviet control, became a socialist state, while West Germany, influenced by the United States, France and the United Kingdom, developed into a capitalist democracy. The Berlin Wall, a physical manifestation of this division, stood as a stark reminder of a nation divided. Yet, even in its darkest hours, Germany held on to the spirit of unity that had birthed it. The wall fell in 1989 and Germany was once again a united nation. The spirit of unity had won over division. This period saw Germany divided but not defeated. Its spirit of unity would eventually win. Fast forward to the present day, Germany stands as a powerhouse in Europe. But how did it get here? In the twilight hours of November the 9th, 1989, a monumental event occurred that would forever alter the course of German history, the fall of the Berlin Wall. 
This colossal concrete barrier, which had divided the city of Berlin for over two decades, was finally brought down, symbolizing the end of the Cold War era. This marked the beginning of a new chapter in Germany's history, paving the way for the reunification of East and West Germany in 1990. Since then, the nation has been on a steady path towards growth and prosperity. Not long after its reunification, Germany emerged as an economic titan, boasting the largest economy in Europe and the fourth largest in the world. It's a global leader in various industries, from automotive with brands like Mercedes-Benz and BMW, to pharmaceuticals with giants such as Bayer. Its economic prowess is not just restricted within its borders, but extends across the European Union, where it plays an influential role in shaping EU policies. But Germany's story doesn't end with economic might. The nation has also demonstrated an unwavering commitment to environmental sustainability. It is a leading force in the transition to renewable energy, with nearly half of its electricity generated from renewable sources. It's also a hub for technological innovation, pioneering advancements in fields such as artificial intelligence, robotics, and electric mobility. Germany's journey from the ruins of a divided nation to a beacon of unity, prosperity, and innovation is truly inspiring. It's a nation that has learned from its past and is constantly striving for a better future. It's a place where commitment to unity, resilience in the face of adversity, and an insatiable thirst for progress are deeply ingrained in its cultural DNA. Today's Germany is a testament to its resilience, innovation and dedication to unity and progress. From ancient tribes to a modern powerhouse, the journey of Germany is truly fascinating, isn't it? Let's take a moment to reflect on the key points we've covered. Germany's tale begins with its intriguing origins, rooted in the days of yore, when various tribes roamed its lands. The tapestry of their cultures, beliefs and languages laid the foundation for the nation we see today. The story continues through the Middle Ages and beyond when the region flourished under the Holy Roman Empire's rule. It was a time of remarkable developments in art, culture and science, and the roots of Germany's intellectual prowess were deeply planted during this era. Yet, a crucial turning point in Germany's chronicle was its journey from division to unity. Following the devastation of World War II, the nation was divided into East and West. This period was characterized by contrasting ideologies, political tensions, and the infamous Berlin Wall. But the spirit of unity prevailed, leading to the fall of the wall and the reunification of Germany. Today, Modern Germany stands as a testament to its rich history and resilient spirit. It's a nation that seamlessly blends the old with the new. The historical architecture of its towns and cities stands shoulder to shoulder with cutting-edge technology, innovative industries and modern infrastructure. Germany's cultural landscape is equally diverse, with traditional festivals coexisting with contemporary art, music and cuisine. Germany's journey has been a truly remarkable one, a testament to resilience and transformation. It's a nation that has learned from its past, grown from its challenges, and continues to shape its future. Germany's story is a captivating blend of history, culture, innovation, and progress. It's a nation that has managed to stay true to its roots while embracing the modern world. Germany's story is one of resilience and transformation, a journey that continues to shape its path forward. And who knows what exciting chapters are yet to be written in Germany's compelling story.